two, three. Oh! I think we made it. Oh. I think we're back to our regular. Let's time. check. <gasps> oh! The time pirate just appeared and disappeared. Wait, let me check my phone. We made it. It's 2019. House family, okay. treasure hunt, active what? Welcome, Mr. E. Mr. E. I've missed being a part of your adventures, but I have been very busy myself. I found a most curious chest locked with a, a strong lock of strange workmanship. I purchased it on an auction many years ago. Over the years, I slowly acquired the three keys needed to open the lock. But I wanted your family to do the auction. <gasps> what? Let me take you on a road. One family on a throne. Cause we got, we got it. We got treasures and mountains, yeah we got. Good morning. Uh, found a house to stay in. That's right. Uh oh. Found Are you allergic to the house? Charlie, we found the treasure. Charlie, we found the treasure. Hi, James. Charlie, tell us about this treasure chest that we found. We were finding this treasure chest, and then. That's the right. Big so, house. last you saw, we entered the home. And we saw something amazing, and now I really am excited to show it to you guys. It is a awesome. huge treasure chest. Check it out, okay? Let's go it's take a look. So, it's right over here. Yeah, it, and it has, has a W a and really a Disney sign. I, I wonder if it means Walt Disney. There's a it, yeah. D and Morkline, Missouri, Missouri, but there's this big lock. And I remember Mr. E saying there was a lock. There's, whoa, I saw it. I never noticed that, it says Mr. E. So I remember Mr. E saying that in the message yesterday that there was a lock of curious workmanship, a very strong lock that doesn't open and he's never even opened it. And he bought this chest on an auction. So do you guys remember from Mr. E yesterday in the message that he sent us, how many keys does it take to open this lock? Three. Good job, it was three keys. So he says there's three keys we need to open this chest. And let's read this first clue, shall we? Corbin, since you found the clue, I'm gonna let you read it, okay, buddy? Oh, it's a cool. That's really cool folding. Yeah. Okay. It's actually like hard to open because of the folding. Uh-huh. And then- Don't wanna rip it or else. We'll never find the treasure. Okay. You made it. Did reading stories of your family make the trip more fun? Which were your favorite books? Do you know what he's talking about? Yeah, what, the Rivet which, app. The Rivet app. What was your favorite book? Um, The bunny one. Because the, it's super close to Rivet. The Easter bunny treasure hunt? Yeah. Okay, what was your favorite? Book? My favorite was that... Uh, Part two and part one of that treasure chest. Of the big treasure hunt? Yeah. Cool. Like the one in Mount Pleasant and at our old house. That's right. Hey Rebecca, what do you think of this treasure chest from Mr. E? Oh, that is so awesome. Yeah. I think the, this whole setup is like great. Like having this huge beautiful house and we come here and there's a treasure chest. That is so <laughs> That's cool. so cool. That now, so cool. did you see that there was a clue behind the lock? No. Yeah, Corbin found this clue behind the lock. He was just reading it. It says Mr. E. Did, it, did reading stories of your family make the trip more fun? So we were Which just, were your favorite books? Yeah, we were just talking about what the favorite books were oh, of the kids. Oh, yeah. So do you want to read the rest of it, yeah. Becca? Now for your next challenge. You must obtain the three keys needed to open this chest. I've hidden them in lands of fancy nearby. You must travel to each one in turn. Find the clue, solve the puzzle, and obtain the key. Work together, be true, Mr. E. Okay. And obtain the key. So where do we go today? 
says Lands of Fancy. You must travel to each one in turn. Have we been there? Lands of Fancy? What's that find mean? Find that fairy? What if you have to find the underlines, like hidden underlines that you can't see and you oh. have to try to find them? Are, are there any letters capitalized or words underlined or anything? I want to take a look. I've hidden them in lands of fancy nearby. Travel to each one in turn. Oh, Find it through the public bubble. Oh, oh. Ooh, is there a... There's tons of theme parks like oh, Disneyland and yeah, Casper and Park. Lands of fancy, that would make sense. Well, what's the Asper. nearest one? It says nearby, Asper. so what's... It's not very far. Yeah. It's very fun, but there's like... Are we really close to Notch Park? We are really close to Notch Park. It's like five minutes away. Is that the closest one? Yeah. Yeah. So should we go? Maybe that's the one we're supposed to go to today. Well, the worst thing that could happen is we go there and then we find out that we shouldn't have gone there, but we'll still have fun. Well, let's go try it. Let's then. go. Guys, check it out. Beach and Orange. Beach Boulevard and Orange Avenue. <laughs> okay. Sounds like some sort of monopoly king. Like <laughs> That's our street. <laughs> They went out to go search for the Mr. E clue. So we're hoping they're gonna be getting some good lucks. Or good luck. Some good luck. Some good luck. They need some good luck. That's fine. Okay guys, here we are at Knott's Berry Farm. We got into the park and we're gonna see if we can find a cookie or a clue or something from Mr. E. So let's start looking around, okay guys? We got Corbin. James with me. Yeah, there's a certain ride I want to go on. Should we ride a ride while we're looking? Okay, yeah. what ride? Let's go. Probably over here somewhere where that's going. That's it. Okay, let's go. Okay guys, I think we found out where the boarding is. It's this really cool like Aztec pyramid ride. The 
James and Corbin are super excited. So let's see if we can get on this ride now. It's called Jaguar. This is gonna be fun, guys. Ooh! Whoa! That's cool. That's cool painting. Okay, guys, now don't forget, what are we here really looking for? The key. The key, so make sure to keep your eyes open for a key. Oh, whoa. Because we might still find the key. We have to find that. That's the whole reason we're here. Skeletons. That's creepy. You guys ready? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Uh oh, guys. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> for mystery so keep your eyes peeled it could be anywhere okay guys this is the kitty land at Knott's Berry Farm they have a lot of fun kids rides and but, just like the but for like ones. Ellie and Charlie little kids love it yeah but they're also really fun for grown-ups too they are really fun do you think that mystery maybe hid the key somewhere over here around here and they're like more experiencing what yeah Corbin, I'm not blaming, I'm blaming myself because I didn't think that it might would fall off. So, but I kind of want to walk around and see if maybe it flew off somewhere and I could find it. I'm going to look around and just see if maybe I can <laughs> get lucky. <laughs> oh, my favorite beach and hat is gone. Maybe I have to get another one now. Oh. 
I'll have to go online on our website, The Treasure Family. I can't believe I lost it. <laughs> All right, guys, what ride are we riding next? I don't know. Corbin had a good idea. You just said you wanted to ride Montezuma's Revenge. <laughs> you said it. I heard you say it. You were joking. Well, I think you're serious. No, I was joking. <laughs> hey guys, the mystery wants us to ride on Montezuma's Revenge. Maybe that's the challenge, and he hid the key no. somewhere on Montezuma's Revenge. So we have to do that no. really scary ride that we're teaching. No. No. But maybe that's the one we're supposed to go on to find no. the key. Okay, let me ask you this: If the key is on the ride, would you go do it? No. No? You can. Then go. we'll never find the key. I can yeah. go on it and you guys aren't going to? Yeah. Maybe I have to go on the ride then. Okay. All right guys, here's the thing. This is the first spin on that last ride that we just went on was right above me. And I think that my hat fell down somewhere around here. This is it. It was right around this spin right here where I lost it. So, it might be close. Look around, guys. Is there? Did you guys find it? Where? Where? Oh, I see it! There it is! My hat! I can see it right here. Can you see it now? Yeah! <laughs> okay, let's go talk to the train conductor and see if he can grab it for us. Okay, I see the train. Let's go get on the train and see if we can grab it. <laughs> I can't believe I'm gonna get my hat back. <laughs> so my dad We saw it. Maybe we can ride on the train. Just around this corner, you can see it like five feet off the track. Okay, thank you. Are you really? Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. It's just around this corner. Just around on the other side, yeah. <laughs> you got it? Okay. Awesome. Thank you very much. All right. Ah! Yeah! We got his hat back. We got my hat back. Yes. Okay. It's a little bit. <laughs> it's a little bit dusty, but it still looks good. Good thing you found your hat. It would have been lost forever. It would have been gone forever. Yeah. When it fell off my head, I just had a feeling it was in an area we should probably be able to get to. So, I'm just glad I have it back. Beach in. The beach house. You guys know you can get your own beach and hat on our website, thetreasurefamily.com. Go check it out. We're going to walk through that cave. What's in the cave? I don't know. We haven't been in there yet. Okay, are we looking for the key? Is that why yeah. we're here? Yeah. Okay, be careful. You guys see anything? We didn't find anything in the cave, so we have to keep looking. All right, so we've been all around the park. We've ridden on rides and looked for this key and we can't find it anywhere from Mystery. So let's go back and find Mom. Maybe Mom found the key. She went to go get some food with the rest of the family. So let's see if she's had any luck, okay? Yeah. All right, let's go. Did you guys find a map? Yes, this is a real map of where we're at. How was lunch? It was 
so good. Yeah. And the so we are right here. Whoa. And Ghost this town map. This shows everything and fun facts about everything that's happened in awesome. this town. Awesome. Any any leads on finding a key from Mr. E? Uh, no. Becca, Becca's in the bathroom. I'm gonna hold on to this because I think it's gonna come in handy. It might. Good call. Yes. Thanks, Jess. So. Good thinking. What do you think of that, James? Is that cool? Ryan used to have one of those. He used to have a board like that. Yeah. Alright, where are we going, you guys? We're going on the Calico Co Railroad. Woo! <laughs> Alright. Everybody's excited. Wow, Charlie, look at all that. Look at all that water. Is that cool? Oh, he's got a messy face. Here we go. Okay, we got a big group here. Ryan gets his own special seat for the special kid. He's gonna be special friends. Yeah. Time for a train ride. I like this. This is a fun train ride. Choo choo, we're all in here. Let's go through. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah? Got Andrew and James and Corbin and Grandma and Grandpa and Charlie. Yeah, Charlie, we love you. Charlie's dad's got the train conductor hat on. <laughs> Shouldn't you be on that side of things, Grandpa? <laughs> oh, man. Hey guys, don't forget, we're here for a specific purpose. What are we looking for? We are trying to keep our eye out for a key. For a key. A key from Mr. E. Mr. Yeah. E. Key. Somewhere hidden in the whole that park. to the treasure chest somewhere. That's right. Yeah, so, uh, uh, peeled, okay guys? Yeah. It is like a needle in a haystack. If you see anything that looks curious. Well, let me know if you see anything, okay? Are you nervous? Is that why you're biting your fingers? <laughs> Corbin's nervous. No, I'm not nervous. I've been on it before. Yeah. Don't spit on my face. Do like this. So, the kids filmed a different video already where they rode on a whole bunch of the favorite rides and they talked about what their favorite rides were. So go check that out on Treasure Family. Meanwhile, Becca and Ryan filmed a fun jelly taste test. Every jelly. Check it out on the Becca and Ryan show. Here we go. Another ride, still no key, Charlie. What are we gonna do now, buddy? We couldn't find a key in that ride. Why? I don't know, did you find it? It's in that water. Is the key in the water? Yeah. Uh-oh. I don't see a key in the water. But there's pennies in the water. There's pennies, but no keys. Let's keep looking, okay, buddy? Yeah. You gotta find it next time. Okay. Okay. Keep looking, I guess. 
All right, we're gonna wait for the next ride, but while we're waiting, let's see if we can find a key in this area. Do you guys wanna look around everywhere and see if you can find a key? Yeah. Okay, let's see if we can find something. What are we doing now? We're trying to find a stagecoach. And we're trying to find a key also. Do you think maybe we'll find a key on the stagecoach? Yeah. It keeps saying thank you, not thank you. <laughs> Ooh, we got seatbelts on the stagecoach. You guys ready for this ride? We got some horses down there. This is going to be really fun. You guys know where mom is? Where's mom and grandma? Inside. They're inside, that's right. We're moving, guys. Here we go, see ya. Did you guys know that uh, like 200 years ago, this is how people used to travel all the time. They didn't have cars, so they'd ride in a stagecoach. But sometimes they wouldn't even have a stagecoach. Sometimes they'd have to walk. Pretty cool. I think we might be able to see the horses from here. You guys see those horses all the way up there? That's what's pulling us. That's how we're moving right now. Is that cool? Yeah. There's a little tiny car. Look, there we go. Look. Yeah, that's Check it out. It's pretty awesome. I wonder where Ryan and Jessica and Andrew went. They went to go do their own fun. Jessica's filming her own video yes, on Jessica's you. workshop. Little tiny car. Go look. Yeah. You know why he's following us? Why? Take a wild guess. Any ideas why? Oh, look at that, guys. Check it out. <laughs> Does that look scary? That would be fun. Going up and down on that thing. I want to go on that. I want to go on that. So he's following us just in case the horse poops and he has to pick it up. That's right, that's why he's got a garbage can. Nature calls, guys. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> Is that funny? <laughs> uh oh, there's some more. Yep. You gotta go, you gotta go, huh? Yep. It didn't break. Oh, you really? <laughs> <laughs> These are some cool rides. Oh, wow. Alright guys, find a spot to sit. What is this thing? It's a sky cabin. Sky cabin? 
Do you think we'll get a good look around the area? <laughs> there he goes. No head. <laughs> okay, we are back with the decision okay, to be made. Okay, fine. I'll go on Montezuma's Revenge. He keeps deciding that he doesn't want to do Montezuma's Revenge because it's too it scary. So but you're not tall enough, my dear. So. Bye, Charlie, you're not tall enough either. Yeah, yeah. Corbin is. Upside down. So, I do we want to go check it out, Corbin? Yeah. Are you sure you're brave enough? Okay, the day's almost over. It's starting to get dark out. So we don't have a lot more time to find that key, but maybe we'll get lucky here on Montezuma's Revenge and find something, okay? Maybe because you're facing your fear. Are you scared? No. Hey Corbin, are you prepared? Serious right now, this is gonna be the scariest ride you've ever been on, buddy. Just you and me, Corbin's the only one brave enough to even try it. Here we go. It might, and it might go upside down. We'll have to see. Corbin, we just finished Montezuma's Revenge and I realized we forgot to do something. We forgot to look for a, for a key from Mr. E. Remember? That's why we're here. Should we go back and look and see if maybe we can find a key? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Look everywhere, guys. Look everywhere. Look everywhere. I see, I see something! Where? Whoa! Where was that? Over there! 
Yeah. On the route? Yeah. This is where the ride was. We just got off the ride and maybe we found it. You think Mr. E put it here at the end of the ride? Yeah. Is that the key we're looking for? Whoa. Can I hold it? What if this is for you, Corbin? What if this is a reward for you facing your fears and riding on the scariest ride? It's not scariest. <laughs> it was scary. You were very scared to ride on it earlier. I wasn't scared. I know, but you faced your fears and you did it. I want to see this. Maybe I should put the thing in because I faced my fears. I think that's a great idea. Can Ellie hold it? What do you think, Ellie? Is that cool? Yeah, it's just TS. Oh. TS. Well, okay. I'm gonna keep it in my pocket until we get home. Okay, cool. Good job, buddy. Let's go. Thank you, Marcy Cook, for all your letters and pictures. And really cool and, and you know. Thank you for the heart you gave me. Thank you, Gillen. Thank you for the sweet pictures you sent out.